Hey guys, welcome back. Um, today is Sunday, March 22nd, and it is about 5 o'clock at night. Been pretty lazy busy, but like that, I know that that's contradictory, but like really that's how today has been. I've gotten a lot of stuff done, but I've also chilled a lot too, so moderation. <laughs> um, my Fitbit is loaded. Um... So yesterday, I knew my steps would be low just because we were in the car so much, but let me zoom you in. Alright, so I only had 1,956 steps. I really, really wanted to go on a walk today, but it has been so rainy and chilly today, like, it just, no. Um, but I do have over 2,000 steps for today anyway, so I didn't work out. I did hit my water goal yesterday, I believe, and I'm going to hit it today. I'm like just a couple steps away from hitting it. Um, I didn't read yesterday, but I have read today. I actually finished a book. I did not get any further on the pantry, so um, it's not getting done this week. And I did not wash the dishes by hand. I did wash the dog blankets. I really did forget to weigh in again, so we'll see. We may just have to put a oop sticker or something. Um, I did wash the sheets. Those are in the dryer right now. I never got around to budgeting just because things have just changed so fast. I'll need to figure out and sit down with my husband next week and budget because... Our county was added to the list of counties going into a 30-day stay-at-home, shelter-in-place kind of situation. So we are stuck at home as of Tuesday, and he's then without a job. So um, I'd already decided against calling the groomers. Now I'm going to... I definitely don't think they'll be open because um, they're not an essential business, I don't think. So... Um, I'll call them on Monday and see. I never got to around to doing some of this work stuff, so it'll be on my list of things to do tomorrow morning. I did film my plan with me. I edited it. I just washed the lights. I'm going to be washing the darks here in just a second, so I am going to cross it off, guys. <laughs> I did upload this, and then... Um... Let me think about what I want to put in here because a lot of this stuff has already happened but I want to figure out what I want to put in here as well. I feel like I knew what I wanted to put in here. I think I'm going to put that I finished reading my book so I'll find some sort of reading sticker um, or I just may just write it in since there's just a lot of deco in here. I'm going to cover this one up I think because this one's really large. I don't think I'll be able to cover that up. So I just want to write in um, a finished reading and then the book that I did. I do have this little star sticker that I think I'm going to write or put here and maybe just write in. I, I gave it four out of five stars. I thought it was pretty cute. Um, it went by pretty fast, so I'm just going to write in the number four. And the stars right there. A little heart just because I want to. Um, it was super cute. Uh, it was definitely, I don't know, I would call it like smut. <laughs> it was, um, it was just a good book. It was, it was fluffy. It was what I needed for my brain right now. Alright, so right here I wanted to put in, I, in my head, like 30 minutes ago, I knew exactly the sticker I wanted to use. Um, and now it is, it is gone. It might come back to me. <laughs> this is definitely not the sticker, but it's going to have to work anyway. Um, I cleaned off my desk. I'm not quite done. I needed to wait until I was done with this spread and then my print pression to be able to consolidate some stickers. But I'm mostly done, and I just wanted to clean my desk so I had a space to work. With my husband being home the next 30 days, starting on Tuesday, um... I needed a place where I could 
shut the door for like my online meetings so um, the spare bedroom where my planner desk is is probably the best area so I like completely cleared it off so I had room for all of my work stuff so it will be a dual purpose space or what would you what would you call it for three things not dual because it's also our spare bedroom anyway <laughs> All right, and then tonight I'll just be sitting down and watching some TV with my husband. I'm pretty sure I'm going to eat cereal for dinner, so I'm going to pull out a cereal sticker. And hopefully it will be good enough to cover up that icon that I want to cover. How cute is this little kawaii puffs sticker? <laughs> Not quite big enough, but we are going to make it work. You can really only tell if you're looking at it really closely. Alright, that is it. So up here in the space, I've done quite a bit today. Just, um, it's, again, it's stuff I've already done, so... Dang it guys, I remembered the sticker I wanted to use. I made tea while I was cleaning my desk because I was going to use my T-Rex tea cup stickers from Fox and Cactus. That's okay. Alright, we got that. Everything in this planner is done. Moving into my print pression. Um, I've seen some work emails come across, none of them have been like super pertinent, so I, I mean like, I'm gonna say that I checked it because I've been cognizant and aware of them. I did post the planner party pick. I never did that work survey. That'll end up getting done this week for sure, so. Um, I did my plan with me. I uploaded the plan with me. I posted my picture in the planner party on the Facebook group. And I'm going to write in clean desk here because it pertains to work as well. Alright, and I did that. So, um, down here, and maybe, I want to use like a full box if I can. Let me see what my options are. Because, I mean, really nothing exciting has happened today. So if I have a full box, that is just a quote. So I have this one, it says start where you are, it's definitely going to be way too big though, so I'd have to cut things down again, which I think is fine, I'll cut it off from the top. Alright, so that is my print pression spread, I'll zoom you out so you can see the full thing. I guess I should have showed you my full spread of my Erin Condor, and so I'll do that real fast, but that is it. The week is done. Oh, I guess I can't consolidate. I thought I was, I don't know why I thought I was into the April set. I still have one more week of the March before I get into April, so I can't consolidate that yet anyway. Let me show you my Erin Condren really fast. Alright, that is how the full spread, I think it turned out really cute. I do love the rainbow color, and then I'm loving, like, the rainbow-ness of this week as well. So, lots of rainbow happening, and I'm okay with it. Oh, you know what I didn't do, though? I didn't cross these all off. And yes, I did just unpack all my bags from going to Portland, so don't judge me. Alright. Doodle planner. Let me zoom in just a touch. And we'll get into this. Um, nothing on the top, per usual. <laughs> um, I didn't read yesterday, but I did post to Instagram. And 
Alright, I, I got all my colors out of order again. Um, I did post to Color Street yesterday. Got my YouTube up. Yesterday, I still need to upload my plan as I go video. It's already edited, but with my plan of me going up this morning, I wanted to space them out a little bit. Then I hit my water goal yesterday. Um, I will say that yesterday was an okay day. Um, but I'm gonna mark this that same bluish color because I ended up being in a really funky mood. My stomach kind of hurt all last night which is starting to become a thing when I eat. My stomach just hurts. Like I think I eat too much maybe for right now, like what my stomach can handle. I'm not really sure. That and we had McDonald's because we were on the road and I'm sure like that did not help at all. So <laughs> Going into this, I'm just gonna write in what we did. Alright guys, so yeah, we drove down to Wichita to get our haircuts, um, and then we did find out that our county, like I think I've mentioned, is going to be shutting down on next Tuesday, so things are starting to get more and more scary. Like I try not to be scared, and I try not, like, I try not to think about it too much. And like there's days like today where I look outside and I'm like it's so gloomy, and we wouldn't have done anything anyway. So like it's not even a big deal, and you kind of forget what's going on around you. And then like I'm just reminded all of a sudden like, you know, no things aren't okay, and people are dying, and. I don't know. So I'm trying as hard as I can to stay positive. Um, as of right now, my doctor's appointment is still on for tomorrow because the county shutdown doesn't start until Tuesday. So I don't know. I, I'll have a lot of questions for my OB tomorrow. So anyway, guys, that is it for Saturday's stuff and into Sunday. So I will have one more video. No. This is it, right? It'll go up on Monday. So yeah, as far as my stuff for Sunday, um, you guys already know really kind of what I've done today because I cleaned my desk. I really probably could finish this off, but I'll do it in the morning. I'm, I think I, I will try and make that my routine. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching my plan as I go videos. I really hope that you guys have enjoyed them and enjoyed watching. I feel like this is probably like the most real my channel has ever been because things were happening in real time or at least as close to real time as possible and you guys were getting to see how my life changed so much in, w in one week's time so um, it is kind of interesting when you go back and look at it that way so anyway I am going to stop rambling but thank you guys so much for watching and I will not be doing a plan as I go series this coming week just because I don't know what work is going to be like, but after that, maybe once things settle down, I may try and do like a once a month type thing. I'm not sure, but I'll keep the ideas open. So, all right, guys, I will see you later. Bye.